hello welcome to my channel so in this video I want to share with you my takeaway order story so um, most I know most Americans um, don't really use the word takeaway usually um, we'll say pick up to go or carry out but I mean it's it's all the same thing but for the remainder of the video I will use the word takeaway so um, it was Friday night and um, my husband and I did not feel like cooking so we decided to order from a takeaway. So I went online to place an order and we decided to go and pick it up. So the takeaway is in a nearby town. Maybe it takes about maybe 10 minutes to get there. So we're running a bit late um, because we were told the order should be ready in 15 minutes. We're a few minutes late, so I mean, that's not a big deal, you know, for a takeaway order. So um, we finally get there, and I get out of the car, and I go in to pick up my order. So I am told that they do not have an order for me, and that I did not place an order. So I was kind of confused, because I had ordered from them before online, and I didn't have any problems. So I had my phone with me, so I took up my phone and showed them a confirmation email. And when I showed the lady behind the counter my confirmation email, she said that I was not at the right takeaway. And I was a little embarrassed and I was like, oh, okay, I'm sorry. And then I walked out. So I got back in the car and then I get a call from the owner of the takeaway that I actually ordered from. And um, he told me, uh, well, he asked me if I was still going to pick up the order. And I said, you know, yes, of course, you know, I'm still hungry. So I'm, yeah, I'm definitely going to pick up the order. And I told him I went to the wrong takeaway. So he gave me directions to his location. And um, luckily it wasn't too far away. All we needed to do was turn around and drive in the opposite direction and make a left down, um, down, down the street. So when I get there, um, I get my food. And I also realized um, the mistake that I had made um, until that day, I did not realize that there were so many takeaways with um, the sim a similar name. Um, so here in the UK, there is a restaurant chain called Nando's. And I'm familiar with it because um, there are Nando's located in the US as well. And Nando's is known for their um, peri peri chicken or the sauce that goes with the chicken, which is peri peri sauce. So the takeaway that I ordered from is a peri peri chicken takeaway. So I thought that it was like a one off type of copycat takeaway of Nando's. I didn't realize that there are so many takeaways here in the UK with Perry Perry um, in their um, title or name of the takeaway. So for example, it could be called like Jack's Perry Perry or it could be Perry Perry Delight. So I mean, I realize now and I and just by driving around, I, I see them um, quite often now. So um, if you ever come to UK, just know that there are so many Perry Perry takeaways. Um, so have you have you done this before? Have you made the mistake of ordering from one Perry Perry uh, takeaway and um, going to another Perry Perry takeaway? Or have you accidentally went to the wrong takeaway or restaurant when you placed the order with a different restaurant uh, with a similar name? So um, yeah, I just know in the future, I will definitely check the name again and the address to make sure I go to the Perry Perry that I actually order from. And I will say um, the Perry Perry takeaway that I order from actually had better food than the one that I thought I'd order from. So um, it was kind of a good thing that I discovered the other one. So if I do get hungry or um, decide not to cook one night, then um, I can go to that one. But anyway, um, that is my video. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Bye.